Defense contractor the National Zhongshan Institute of Science and Technology on Tuesday demonstrated its drone arsenal, which has just been expanded. The institute has developed a single rotor drone that is ideal for the needs of urban and coastal surveillance. The new drone adds to an ars arsenal that already includes mid-range marine reconnaissance and long-range satellite-guided dro drones, giving the military more tools to meet its ends. The institute said it has also trained a hundred drone pilots across all branches of the military. This single rotor drone will mainly be used for reconnaissance in urban areas and along beaches. Its guidance system has a range of 30 kilometers and it can stay in flight for one hour at a time. Then there's this fixed wing drone, the Tengyun, also from the National Zhongshan Institute of Science and Technology. It uses satellite guidance, can reach mid to high altitudes, and remain airborne for up to 20 hours. It can take off and land on its own, making it useful for monitoring enemy movements. Another drone designed by the Institute is the Albatross, also known as the Zhongxiang-2, which was first put to use in August when China's PLA conducted drills all around Taiwan Island. The Albatross's primary purpose is surveillance missions over the sea, and it has a guidance range of 150 kilometers and a maximum flight time of 12 hours. Officials say the drone is ideal for search and rescue missions on the open waters. Ever since we developed the Albatross, we have been training drone pilots for all branches of the military. So far, we have trained roughly 100 pilots, and they have all passed the Civil Aeronautics Administration's test. With many people concerned over Chinese investments in Taiwanese companies, as well as the use of China-made components in Taiwanese tech, the institute said it strictly filters manufacturing partners. Manufacturers we work with undergo strict background checks to ensure they haven't received funding from China and don't do business with China. In the bidding process for these manufacturing jobs, there is always some confidentiality involved. With tensions in the Taiwan Strait high, the institute is putting its full effort into ensuring the military has all the tools it needs to defend the country. With drones becoming increasingly important to modern warfare, Taiwan is set to develop the latest in drone technology.